It was wild. Very beautiful young ladies moving. You hadn't seen nothing like that, and it was pretty exciting. But after their first flurry of singles in the early 60s, Ike and Tina couldn't score a hit. Recording on small labels, they released seven albums in a row that failed to chart. And the harder Ike worked, the less he had to show for it. We were playing clubs that were like maybe 250, 300 people maximum. And often the clubs were nothing short of raggedy. Without a hit record, his price was going down. You know, there were less and less people at his concerts, and he had a huge nut. 